House Project. It'll be led by Roald Gunderson, who's an architect of Whole Tree Systems. We probably can get started with it with our own funds, but to do a really good job of it and make sure that we have uh, something to cover various contingencies, um, we should probably be looking for somewhere around fifty to $25,000 of, of external support. The Tiny House Project will be the size of a shipping container, roughly 8 by 8 by 20. Solid enough that it can be stacked like shipping containers, but it's not a metal box. So it's a uh, natural materials tiny house that can serve many functions, not just a living space, but also a shipping container, uh, which could include relief supplies or parts of other tiny houses. The whole project will be documented by students and submitted with the tiny house business plan for the Dutch government's green challenge for carbon abatement. It's a, a great way to pull together a lot of different aspects of the sustainability curriculum. There's so much more that goes on above and beyond building a house. Certainly building a house involves learning skills that everybody should learn and most people don't have a chance to. And learning the kinds of skills that are involved in, in building a house of any kind, including a tiny house, are learning those skills is it's transformative, it's confidence building. But you're not just building a house, you're planning for it, you're doing the budgeting for it, you're understanding why tiny houses are valuable. Either way, whether we sell the project at the end, sell the tiny house at the end, or keep it on campus, uh, we'll be getting benefit from it. I feel that this is a particularly high leverage donation. Um, the cost is not especially great, uh, but the impact on students, the impact on our curriculum, the publicity that will come from this course for the university to recruit more students who would like to come and have experiences like this, more students to come who are of the sort, who want to transform themselves and be part of transforming the world. It's really a high leverage donation and I think we will see a lot of result from it. I would be so excited to have that kind of an opportunity. I think, I think it's a very valuable experience to, an opportunity to have on campus to actually be able to like dive into something where you have a product or at least can see the product emerging from the work that you're doing. It'd be great if someone would donate so we can learn how to build sustainable structures. Um, so I think it's it's something, it's a a path that the world is taking. I would very much appreciate the Tiny House course donation because it's a great opportunity for all of us. It's a worthwhile investment and I think the people and students at MUN are forward thinker, thinkers. They're activists and advocates for this whole new world. Honestly, like having something, a course like this offered is enough to make my entire experience here worth coming. So like to me personally, I feel that it has that much value. Um, so for it to get support is, is like more than somebody could even really ask for. <laughs>